calculating the molecular formula given empirical formula and molar mass. In this example problem it says a compound with an empirical formula of CH2 has a molar mass of 70 grams per mole. What is the molecular formula? So we have to first go through the answers and see if any of them do not match up with the empirical formula. So which one of these molecular formulas does not have the empirical formula CH2? And if I go on if I go through all of them and divide by the number that can go into each of the subscripts, I see that they all have the empirical formula CH2. So if I divided this by 2, I would get CH2, the subscripts. If I divided the subscripts by 4 here, and if I, if I divided the subscripts by 5 here, I would get CH2. So we have to use the molar mass to tell us which one of these is the molecular formula we're looking for. So if I go through and calculate the molar mass of each, this one is going to be 14 grams per mole. This one is going to be 24 grams per mole. This one is going to be 56 grams per mole. And the last one is going to be 70 grams per mole. And we see that this matches up with what we have here. And so e, D must be the answer to our question because it matches the empirical formula and the molar mass.